so I'm recording this in February 2022 and this is the longest my hair has ever been it's about 14 inches I haven't gotten a haircut since June of 2020 I distinctly remember that day because uh, we had just reopened haircuts and it was a big relief to me and um, we, we were thinking about going back to the office at the time, obviously. Obviously, it did not turn out the way that we thought it did. A little bit of background on why I stopped um, cutting, started keeping my hair long like this. Uh, back in 2013, I went to my first Computer Olympiad conference. It was held in Yokohama, and I had a really good time. And I especially uh, had a good time with this girl that was at the conference, and she touched my hair. And after that, I wanted to keep that here, a little bit of sentimental value. Eventually, it grew to be about 10 inches long, and I donated that hair. And so I learned about donating hair. And I haven't lost a strand of hair since then. I've donated every piece of hair that I've grown since 2013, if you can believe that. Now, every time I keep my hair, I often like to think about what events have transpired since I've had that hair. Um, so this hair I've kept since June 13, 2020. Uh, among other things, this hair has traveled with me to eight different states, if you can believe it. Let's count them. Washington, Oregon, California, Idaho, Montana, Utah, Arizona, Nevada, if you can believe it. It has seen three lunar eclipses. Obviously, two of them were only penumbral. One of them was a, it was a partial eclipse. Uh, it has seen the conjunction of Jupiter and Saturn. It's probably going to see the conjunction of Jupiter and Neptune in April. It has seen two girlfriends. It has seen two different uh, solo sexual relationships that I've held with myself. I give nicknames to different phases in my life where I've become solo sexual. So the last relationship with myself, I nicknamed the Six Feet Apart, obviously, where I was uh, stuck at home and uh, enjoying all the things that I love with my personal space. This current one I name Reemerge, re where I'm reemerging with others and I'm enjoying my solo sexual life in the company of others who are, hopefully some of them are solo sexual as well. Um, it has seen two different um, computer gaming conferences, obviously both of them were remote. Uh, it has seen me bowl a 242 score in bowling. And um, in backgammon, it has seen me go from a beginner to an intermediate. And I wouldn't rule out the idea that I'll probably take this hair with me to the grave. I like it so much, and I, I, I like growing my hair out now.